Okay, so we got the roof all done there. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick a block on each one of these. And then I'm going to come back with my stairs on each one. Stair there. And then I want a... Oops, I don't have them. Half slab underneath. And then we'll put one here, here, here. Half slab. And do we need one there? No. Okay, so then right here we want that guy, that guy, that guy. Then we want a half slab on top. And I believe that's exactly how I made this roof over here. Oh, no, I added one more. Do I think it needs it though? Hmm. I mean, it kind of looks lopsided without it, but it, then it kind of looks lopsided there as well. I think I'll leave it. Yeah. This one looks different. I think it's just because it's lower. That works. So basically what I want to do now is I want to copy all of this. So that's going to end up going like that. So that. Regardless, uh, let's see. I'll fill in those gaps later. So let's do this. Let's go up here. Select you. Oh, I'm gonna have to go all the way down here. Select you, and then we'll select. say expand 8-8 eight, eight, which makes it expand both directions and yep got enough and then we need two up two up and then what we'll do is we'll go find the center again which should be right here and then we'll say copy rotate 90 paste and we're gonna really mess up our stairs here so we'll just keep doing it and then we'll come back Theory, I should be able to just do it one more time. And that should fix. Which it did, although it kind of broke. I should have used a different uh, paste command, but. 
Wow, did I really only get that much? It did. Let's see. Let's do undo four. All right. And then we'll copy this again. So this is another part of the command that I haven't showed you guys yet. I am going to step on this step. Is that right? Okay, so then we'll say copy. Then we'll say rotate 90. And then we'll say paste minus the air. So we won't paste the air. We'll rotate 90, paste minus the air, rotate 90, paste minus the air, and then we'll do it one more time. And then we'll have to come in and break these out. And then we'll break those out. And that should essentially fix everything. Okay, so let's do some beam work up here. If we do something like this, how's that look? Ominous sounds. I don't know what's going on right there. I think I got some mess up from that. Okay, so what I want to do here. One up and one, two, three, four, five, six. Oops. And then we'll say move one. And then we'll put one little guy there. Do I like this for the chair layout? Yeah, it doesn't need to be overly crowded. Yeah, I'll fix those later. So... Corner posts. How do we do our corner posts? Like that, I think. okay from outside and I don't need those it's kind of dark up in here a 
A little bit of light shed on the subject. Dark again. Okay, so clean this up. Come on, get unstuck there. Okay, so I'm going to fill in these beams and I'll be right back. Okay, so here is the roof on the outside. And I haven't decided if I want to make the peak in the center. I may do that just so like it's like the owner's house or something. I don't know. So I think it all turned out pretty good. Let's go inside here real quick. So we've got our little shops. I think instead of having this like so, I think I'm just going to fill this in. So oh, these can be like uh, benches, basically. For weary shoppers to sit down on and then you go up here you've got your like food court area there's like a little kitchen back there got all your seating and then I haven't decided if I want to make this go up or if I just want to leave this this nice open area up here but what I may end up doing is is just kind of walling off each one of these and just making this the the upper level if I want to do an upper level but for now I think I'm gonna leave it alone and call this build done so thanks for watching bye bye